dynamic loads. The challenge for anyone who's got a liquid load is uh, you can't lash down liquid. Our trucks aren't full for a lot of the time. You couple that with the fact that you're going around corners and uh, all of a sudden you have a load on board which can be up to 42 tonne, rapidly pushing to the side of the tanker. There's a two second slosh cycle, so the milk sloshing backwards and forwards typically takes two seconds. This is a model of, of um, as true to life as you can get, of milk actually sloshing in a tanker. It continues on for quite some time, going through a roundabout, sloshes backwards and forwards. The timing is critical. 